What is going on, Colts Nation? Welcome back to Bring the Juice. Guys, we got some news here. According to Zach Kiefer, friend of the show of The Athletic, the Indianapolis Colts and NFL sources are convinced that Indianapolis Colts owner Jim Ursay will be making a strong push to lure Michigan head coach Jim Harbaugh into being the Indianapolis Colts 2023 head coach. Now, obviously, a lot of speculation, a lot of things can happen, a lot of moving parts here, but wow. I mean, my initial thoughts, I mean, Jim Harbaugh would be a slam dunk hire, in my opinion. He was a slam dunk hire. He would. He'd be a guy that I think would come in here and establish a culture. He's shown that he can be, you know, a successful head coach at collegiate level and also at the NFL level, right? He took the 49ers, Colin Kaepernick, all that crew to the Super Bowl, uh, nearly won a Super Bowl as a head coach. And so, you know, does he want to get back into that, right? Does he want to potentially get back into being a head coach and actually win a championship, right? And I think that's the first question that I have is, does he want to leave the collegiate level, right? Because he's got a good thing going at Michigan right now. He really does. You know, they have a chance to compete for the title this year, and uh, he's really rebuilt that program. So, you know, does he like where he's at? You know, is there anything that, you know, would – he potentially entice him to, to bring him to the NFL level, to the Indianapolis Colts. We know he's been interviewing. You know, we, we know he interviewed with the Vikings head coach vacancy a year ago. So he's clearly interested in some capacity. But does he look at the current job openings and decide Michigan's a better fit still, right? And he holds off. That's my question. We already know that him and Jim Irsay, right, have a good relationship. Obviously, Harbaugh was here in the 90s as a quarterback, nearly led the Colts to a Super Bowl. Uh, you know, appearance and all that stuff. And so he's got ties to the organization. That is definitely something that has legs. Uh, Jim Irsay and Jim Harbaugh, actually, I believe, according to Ian Rappaport, had dinner a few weeks ago. So, you know, is that kind of the start of the conversations? So my number one, does he want to leave college? Number two, does he want to come here? Right? Because it's not the most enticing head coaching job right now. You don't have a franchise quarterback, right? And that's a huge deal. So does Jim Harbaugh, you know, feel like he wants to basically, you know, maybe be not great for a couple of years, you know, and rebuild this Indianapolis Colts program here, uh, you know, with a rookie quarterback? It's most likely the Colts will get their pick of the litter pretty much, depending what Houston does, you know, at a quarterback. Does Jim Harbaugh want to take on that challenge of drafting a rookie quarterback and then trying to develop it, right? We already know what he's been able to do uh, with different quarterbacks, you know, through college and things like that. So, you know, is Jim Harbaugh, former quarterback, would he be able and would he be interested in kind of just starting with a rookie and building it from there? I think that's another question mark for me. Um, and then third, what's it going to take to get him here, right? I mean, is he going to want – what kind of control is he going to want? I would think he'd want something to say with the personnel, you know, seeing how he did that in college. Is that something where you kind of give him, you know, head coaching job – but also some some front office stuff too, right? What is the kind of role that Jim Harbaugh wants? Is, is that something that Jim Ursay is comfortable with? Because Jim Ursay has kind of said all along that he expects Chris Ballard back. So how does that dynamic play out? That's another question that I have. But guys, nonetheless, a very interesting report that I've read about Jim Harbaugh. Uh, we're coming out here. We're actually going to be recording later today. Um, our list of potential head coach candidates from you know, college, NFL level, anywhere and everywhere. We're going to have a huge, massive look at each and every potential candidate here for the Indianapolis Colts. Just as your Merce said, there's a lot of good coaches in college, a lot of good coaches at the NFL level. So, guys, we will be doing that. Be sure to be on the lookout for that. Be sure to hit that like button. Be sure to subscribe. Keep up to date. Hit the notification bell so you are notified when we come out with more news like this and other things like that regarding the Indianapolis Colts. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. We really appreciate all the support. And as always, guys, go Colts. Yeah.